My name is Io Jones and I'm from expatlife.com. We moved from Houston, Texas four years ago already. And how does it feel being here after four years? Um, how does it feel? Like home. Like that's the way it should be. And you've built a community here. How did you do that? Because there's a lot of people who come and within two years they're gone. Yes. <laughs> I think the part about building community was not only about finding other people to share our journey with, but also make sure that we continue to have connections and feel like we were with people who understood what this process was like and could commiserate a little bit and make it feel like having the emotions that came along with moving was normal. <laughs> so what would you say overall about moving to Ghana? Um, overall, have a plan. Do not think that it's going to solve all of your ails or fix all of the things that are bothering you, but know that there's options for you outside of what you've been told and having the experience will let you know if this is for you or not. So we were on a show coming from America. Oh, it was, <laughs> it was um, interesting to see how what we filmed gets displayed on the show. And so we're still seeing what the journey is like, but watching the other families navigate through their own journeys, I'm very thankful not only that Tony and I were able to do the things we did the way we did them, but that we built a community so that people who come after us don't have to feel like they're doing it alone or they don't know what to anticipate or that they don't have a touchstone. So hopefully, I think the biggest takeaway is if you come here with some connection, you'll be more successful and hopefully we've provided that as best we can. Last question. What piece of advice would you give to somebody moving here with children? Moving here with children is a little more challenging. I don't know that there is a right answer for what the process is supposed to look like, but my kids enjoy a kind of life that we could not find in the States. And even though there are sacrifices in that for their lifestyle, there's something about being here that allows them to grow in a way that can't be replicated in their American in their American way of life. So coming with kids, it's worth it's worth it if you can make it all work and keep your kids connected and grounded. But you can do it.